Hey YouTube, Doug Wallman. I'm going to go out tonight and try to shoot the Aurora Borealis. Hopefully I'm saying that right. Otherwise known as the Northern Lights, my Aurora app is looking maybe, maybe pretty good. So I'm going to go out and see what we can find. Aurora Borealis. Okay, I did find a nice place. Um, pretty nice. I'm going to go ahead and do my shots. I'll upload them when I'm done. <laughs> All right, thank you. All right, so I finally got it framed pretty good. And that's what it looks like. You'll see nothing with the iPhone here. I bet I could take a picture with my iPhone. So at least on my Canon 5D Mark IV, I accidentally shot everything in JPEG. I just assumed it was in the raw position, but it was in JPEG. But you know, it seemed like it had a more natural appearance, perhaps. So it's okay, it's all good. So this looks like the last shot I took before heading back to the city or the outskirts of the city. Alright guys, I'm out here late at night at the park. I did drive back. I think I left my light out somewhere in a remote place. I have to go back and get it. Bummer. So I almost gave up on the R7 because I noticed, of course, the Canon 5D Mark. Four did a much better job. Let's give it another shot here. This is the R7 again. Looks like it does a pretty good job as well. Let's see. It's hard for me to navigate this one in the dark because I can't see. I don't remember where the buttons are as much because it's new to me. So. So here are some of the better shots I took while I was at the park. It was amazing despite the city lights and everything that we had some pretty obvious signs of the northern lights. All right. So I had to head back out to the country. I'm guessing it's 25, 30 miles to find my tripod and a light was on top of the tripod. See, I was in the ditch laying down, so it wasn't too hard to find, but I did have to look. But it's way 
I mean, I think it's way more intense out here now than when I left, so we'll take a few more shots. What is it, like almost 4 o'clock, maybe 3.30 in the morning, something like that? Okay, so the Canon 5D Mark IV kind of kicks butt when it comes to this. Uh, the R7 is fine too, but it's kind of like if I have limited time to do it, I've been mostly shooting on the Canon 5D Mark IV, a little bit on the R7, so. Any hoosers, I better get to shooting a few more photos and I'll head back. Oh, all nighters. Pretty much that's what it is now. But I think it was worth it seeing how much more intense it is now. The Aurora Borealis, or the Northern Lights. And it looks like this is the last photo I took out there before heading back. So this is 4.42 a.m. on May 11th, 2024. Hey guys, thanks for watching this YouTube video. I appreciate it. Remember to like, subscribe, and comment. And we will see you in the next video. I really do hope you enjoyed these pictures. It was a fun adventure, really. Buddy, yeah, I got pretty late. <laughs> All right, thank you. No, we're not recording.